YouTube, YouTube, YouTube was popping. You know that grind ain't stopping. Shout out to my notification gang. Don't forget to give that bell a ring, man. It's your boy, Car Reviews by KJ. And hey, don't forget to like that video. But on the other hand, we're doing some work on the uh, good old Fox today. Got a whole bunch of new parts on her. Right now I'm changing the alternator. You see I stripped the wires. Don't worry, don't worry. Unplug that battery, you know, so we won't die. Excuse this, I was about to go live on Instagram. This is my little setup for going live while I'm working on the car. But we got a whole bunch of new parts for the Mustang, man. Get it running good, get it running straight. Got that good old, oh, 65 millimeter. Factory, rusty, cheap, bent, EGR spacing. The old 75, I mean 65 millimeter throttle body right here. All this corroded and dirtiness. We also got a new alternator, so I think this is the problem. This is why my car kept dying. I thought it was because of the uh, throttle body I replaced, but apparently I got a brand new battery and the car kept dying. So pretty much has to be the alternator. And I, I got two tins I haven't showed y'all in the trunk. Can't pop the trunk right now because uh, wait, actually I can't show y'all that real quick. Little side track, little side track. That trunk. I got two kick of tins back here. Two little shallow mounts. Shout out to my boy Smith Zonian for donating these. I got this amp from a uh, thrift store for like five dollars. Hey man, don't sleep on the thrift. So these things hidden. Don't worry about all of that. <laughs> don't worry about that. <coughs> we'll worry about that later. All right. So yeah, that's that's why that's what I think. Cut my uh, name alternator go out because I had the tins in there and I had a super old battery. It was beating it down, so the alternator had to do all the work. So I got me a new 75 uh, 75 amp alternator, and I think this one right here was a uh, 65. So this one should be better. As you can see, this one got a 12 on it, and this one got a 21 on it. Not really sure what the difference is, but it will make the engine bay look a lot better versus this. One. And I also got. The 70 millimeter uh, throttle body and the 70 millimeter EGR spacer. This is the BBK one. Hey man, American Muscle. I'm about to talk to y'all uh, marketing department. We trying to get sponsored, baby. Hey, I don't know. It ain't too many people out here with a Candy Fox body. So, hey man, we need that sponsorship. So, hey y'all, tag them on Instagram or something. Let them know your boy looking for a partnership because I'm going to be contacting them. I ain't playing. I spent a lot of money with them over the years. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, connect these wires. It is right here, crank it down. Yep. And we're gonna hopefully be back in the game. I got everything new, I got a new uh, new belt. I'm replacing everything on this car. New plugs and wires. What else? New distributor cap, new coil. On the coil pack back there, new battery. Hey man, I ain't playing around. I just spent a decent amount to have this thing running good. So yeah, once I get this alternator fixed, we're gonna be there. Hey, and follow me on Facebook and Instagram, Car Reviews by KJ. I'm doing a giveaway. I can't really do it on here, I guess. So I gotta do it on Facebook and Instagram. I'll be doing uh, two fifty dollar giveaways. My links should be in the description. They always in the description. So go to any one of my videos or even this video right here. And then uh, you can follow that page, follow those pages. And then I'll follow, I'll put the instructions and everything like that on there. So y'all know what to do. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead, get this over with. Cause it's pretty, it's a little steamy out here. Go ahead and knock this out. And we'll be back with the finished product. And should be running like a champ. Shit. All right, y'all, finally got this belt on. Sweating like a, you know what I was gonna say, but I ain't gonna say it. Check me out. The alternate dinner looking nice. Make everything look even more old. Get this box out of here, man. I need to clean up the garage, but I'm moving. This is a temporary house, so that's why you see all this stuff on the side. We're keeping everything in boxes, so that way it's easier to just move. And I uh, put everything on the on the moving truck. But anyways, man, 
Got the alternator in there, look brand new. Oh, it is brand new. So I got the wires on there, so I gotta give me a heat gun or some, uh, I'm gonna use my wife blow dryer. <laughs> use my wife blow dryer to get that thing uh, put on. I mean, to get that to shrink wrap. Damn, it's like... So we're gonna do that. I gotta pop the uh, radiator hose back on because uh, I want the room to work. Pop the uh, negative terminal back on. We're gonna crank this thing up and see if we in the game. Since I added that uh, throttle body, it's been giving a loud like whistle. Like you can tell it's breathing a lot better and the, the uh, throttle response is a lot, the throttle response is a lot more, um, you know, on point. Uh, yeah, man. Just trying to think, trying to breathe. I need one of the things that go right here. What's some things called? They go right here. The little uh, thing that you can put over your car so I won't have to lean over and scratch stuff up. I need one of them. I don't know what it's called for sure. But all right, I'm gonna put this thing all the way back together and y'all gonna get the, y'all gonna get the first start up to see if we back in the game. Boy, it is hot. I'm about to go get some water before I pass out out here. Cause uh, this ain't life. This ain't life. All right, y'all. Right, Everything back together. Battery tight. Radiator hose tight. Alternator sitting over there waiting to be rain. Let's see what we got. Wrong set of keys. Let's get this drill out of here, man. Yeah, I got purple lights. Came in the car. I plan on getting blue ones, but these not bad. And also I gotta do a review on this uh, Viper alarm I got put on here. I would've got auto start, but it's a real car. Got the manual, what everybody else say. And you know, you gotta hit the, I don't know. You gotta hit it every time you start it. But when you pull up to a light, you gotta do it. See? through this garage. Seem to be doing all right. Let's see what we got. Something up here rattling. I might get this. I want to switch it out and get a coyote motor in here. But if I can't have AC, I don't want it. I want to take this thing around. Uh, my bad, we cut out. But I want to take this thing around the block. But last time I went around the block, I ended up getting towed home by the police. And now I'm kind of scared. But it got to be done, man. It got to be done. We got to see if we fix. All right, y'all. I'm going to let y'all know if everything go good. Y'all pray for me. I'm going to take it around the block. See if it do its thing. If not, bringing it straight back to the garage. All right. 